hello guys um, now let's do another exercise and this is going to be exercise uh, 4 3 and uh, I'm trying to make sure that everything is clear about array okay like here we create an array so I'm going to create an another array and this array I'll uh, generate random numbers and these random numbers I'll loop through these numbers and count and see how many and get the count of those numbers like let's say how many tens how many one how many twos how many threes in within that random numbers from one zero to one hundred so to get started let's let's create our class and uh, this time I'm I'm going to create a class and I'll use the template main method and class is going to be ex um I think we are 43 now 43 and I'll create I'll pick this public static void main here method it's a template and um, finish and once I have finished I'll delete the comments and I'll create an array this array is going to be int count and it's going to be new um, int and I'm going to pass uh, 10 spaces I'm going to create an array of size of 10 okay and then I need to create a for loop I less than 100 and then I plus plus okay and within within this for loop I just want to generate random numbers so I'm going to say int value and this value is going to be math dot random okay and I just want to concatenate this random this uh, random numbers to int. So what we do here, I think you have done this before int, and then you put this math also into brackets. And I just want to play with two digits. So what I have to do here, I'm going to uh, times ten. Okay, so this is going to be it's going to give me why uh, one digit actually. So it's only one digit. So one, two, three, one, two, three, and you see. So I'm looping through this from zero to one hundred, and here I'm generating these random numbers. And once I, uh, every loop, I want to add these random numbers to to the count. So how do you do that? You have to use count, then plus plus, and here you need to pass the value here because we want to add uh, these values. It's going to loop from zero to one hundred, and each time it's looping, we want to add this to these ones to this count. So I'm going to add value here. Okay, so. And, and now I just want to print the size of this array now I just want to print the uh, I mean to, to loop again I'm going to say okay for int i is equal to zero i less than count dot length I mean the length of this array okay and uh, here this is also another method of adding data to the arrays so once you create an array it's just sitting there empty and each index of this array is zero by default so start from zero one two three so this time I'm going to add these random numbers and these random numbers is going to take the size of this array okay size of this array so a semicolon and i plus plus okay and then 
I just want to print each time I want to print because this is for loop again each time from 0 to the length of this array or the the size of array which is 10 I just want to print each time I want to print the index and the value or the data within that index if it's 0 then we need to find um, how many counts like how many counts if it's number 10 how many counts in, within this uh, um, uh, this random numbers from 0 to 100 the random numbers how many tens how many fives so that's what I want to show you here so what I'm going to do here I'm going to use the let me use a, a new string builder and the first thing I'm going to pass a string here I'm going to say count four and then I will append I will append um, this i here which is an index so I append this i and then let me append is another string is and then let's convert the, no no let's append again be short here and um before this I need to append let's append the now the count array which is count pass array here and you pass this uh, which is the value all this the count you see array so if we save and try to run this program you see and here so you see so zeros are 13 1 is 8 count for 2 is 6 count for uh, uh, 6 is 15 so there is 15 6 in this loop here we are passing these random numbers here and uh, if we add these numbers or these this count is going to give us uh, 100 so thank you guys for your time and remember subscribing bye bye